G'day guys, welcome to another episode. So this time round, me, Brooke and Isla, a couple of mates all got together, went up to the islands for a night. Yeah, we had a ball, had the um, prawn trawler come in unload, so we got a bit of a look at all these dolphins. And yeah, it was a bit of a highlight for everyone. Alright, hope you enjoy the video. Subscribe, cheers. That's the closest you've seen dolphins, isn't it? God, they're everywhere, aren't they? Is this like this every morning, mate? The office? Hard life.
trying to pick myself up I may be living alone But I still believe in love And although my flaws had dragged me down on the coldest night I'm still kicking around And then I saw you back before my time What's your take? Alright guys, so we're home from another big weekend had a ball up the islands with all the mates and the little family and that. And um, a bit of a highlight with all the dolphins and yeah. Anyway, while I was diving, I didn't catch you some footage, but there was a nice trout and I've speared it. And as the shaft's gone through and it started kicking, this little bugger's come out and wanted a slice of it. I never caught it on video, but it's a big hockey. Looks pretty gross because I've boiled it last night for about an hour. Apparently that's the go. And um, so what I've got to do now is skin it. And then I've got all my stuff here. I'm going to make a bit of a numbers up and um, pickle it in a jar. That's the ingredient. I don't know how this is going to go, but yeah. One way to find out. It is literally halved in size since I boiled it but it smells yummy, keen to give it a go. Right, I'm finally finished. It took like half an hour to do that little bit. I'm gonna do it hot next time, but anyway. Look at them beautiful legs. They're gonna be delicious. It's um, softer than I expected. All right, we'll cut it all up and get it in the jar. Alright, yeah. uh, that looks good to me. Yeah, a little bit more chopping. Yep. Alright, a couple of tomatoes out of the garden. Didn't get much love in these ones. Tiny, but they'll be yummy. It's nice. Big shout out to Brooke's mum. Mm-hmm. Forever sharp. Yeah boy, my new favourite knife. Alright, a bit more of that. I'm definitely gonna lose a finger one day with this knife though. <laughs> right, chuck all that in. Can't leave any little pieces of Oki behind because it's so delicious. Alright, now we need a um, bit of soy. About, um, about, about that much. A bit of vinegar. White vinegar, gotta have white vinegar. This actually cooks it all. That you beauty. Oh, no. What else? A bit of salt and pepper and a bit of chili flakes. And we're ready to go. Right, that's how easy it is. When you're out on the boat, especially in the tropics, you should always have white vinegar on board for jellyfish stings. And um, if you forget to take food and you're starving, you can always chop a bit of fish up, add the vinegar. And yeah, crayfish, trout, any sort of fish. Trevally and Queenie are actually the best fish for this um, numbers. But yeah, there you go. So you give that 20 minutes, chuck it in the fridge, give it 20 minutes, half an hour, hour, whatever, and just into it. I'll have a little taste now. It's been two minutes. Hmm, doesn't matter. It's just so good. Lovely. Alright guys, <clears throat> hope you enjoyed the video, plenty more to come, so um, yeah, we'll see you next time, cheers.